go guys, this game export here today, and I'm bringing you another brand new video. Today's video is going to be an another exotic gun review. So today's exotic gun review, we will be reviewing this hand cannon, the last word. As you all know, all exotic hand cannons reserves were reduced, so you will be running out of ammo and stuff. But anyway, for the muzzles, we have soft ballistics, which is less recoil, penalty to impact, Next, we have Smart Drift Control, which is predictable and controllable recoil, but there's a penalty to range, which would be really horrible or worse because range on this weapon is really not good. Next, we have Aggressive aggressive Ballistics, which is more predictable recoil, enchanted enhanced impact, and short shorter range and more recoil, which really isn't good. This one, I mean, this is... The muzzles you guys can pick on however you guys like them, but I just go with soft ballistics. Okay, so the exotic Perkins gun, there's a fan, it's, I don't know, it's not the exotic one, but it's the fan fire. This weapon can be fired quickly and continuously. The next we have the hip fire. This weapon has bonus accuracy while firing from the hip. So if you want to use this gun, learn how to use it from the hip firing, and if... The person gets out of your hip fire range in PvP, you just uh, aim down the sights. Next, we have single point sling, which is switch weapons faster and move quicker while aiming. So that's really good. And next, we have high caliber rounds. Oversized rounds build to stagger targets and leave them reeling. Their mass makes a weapon harder to handle. And then next, we have perfect balance. This weapon has a creamy low recoil. I go single point sling because most of the time when I'm playing PvP, the guys are usually out of my zone of hip fire, and the range is not good in this weapon, so I just like to sometimes pop down the scope and, well, not scope, down the aiming sights and then just kill them that way. And this is the exotic, um, the exotic perk, and it is last name, last word, bonus damage and stability, extra precision damage when firing from the hip, so you get extra accuracy when you're firing from the hip, and extra precision damage so basically headshots they deal, deal more damage okay well first let's head off to talk about this gun in pvp this gun is really great for medium to close range combat this weapon the range was reduced and so the long range really isn't going to be good anymore so uh year one this weapon could was able to shoot it across the map but now it's not anymore so that's so now with uh in pvp you basically want to use it when you're playing small maps or you can just run it with a sniper or shotgun actually if you want to rush but i would use it with a thousand yards there black spindle of course well actually you can't because that's an exotic okay so then the rate of fire the rate of fire is I mean, you have fan fire on this, so the rate of fire is really, really big. Impact, this gun is a lot. Range, this gun has really low range. And the stability is pretty good on this gun. And next, the reload. The reload speed is pretty good. But I would suggest using... If you guys don't... If you guys only fight, aim down the hip with this weapon, I would suggest using high caliber rounds. Okay, well, let's go to the PvP side of this, PvE side of this weapon. I would, please, just please do not use this gun in PvE. The magazine is 8. It has 8 bullets in the magazine, which you have to reload constantly, and when you have a bunch of ads around you, you are not getting anywhere with this gun. Up, right now, you will see some gameplay of, you should see it about now, uh, where I always have to reload, and the, I just run out of ammo really quickly, and then using it to hip fire isn't good because most of the bosses you need to do headshots even though this does give some extra precision damage with fire from a hip well thank you for watching guys this is the ha the beautiful the last word hand cannon exotic gun review thank you for watching don't forget to leave a subscribe leave a like and subscribe leave your feedback down below in the comments and thank you for watching have a great day